Thank you for watching, liking, commenting, sharing, and subscribing right now. What do you do when you're stressed out? And more importantly, what do you do when you know you've got to do something that's going to stress you out even more? Like doing your taxes? Well, I've got a, a few ideas, uh, things that I might recommend that would help get you through a difficult situation, such as doing your taxes. Uh, first thing I would recommend is wearing comfortable clothes. Now, if you're comfortable in a three-piece suit, by all means, wear that. If you're more comfortable in a hoodie and jeans, wear that. Be comfortable when you're doing something that's potentially stressful. Number two, surround yourself with favorite snacks. They're like mini motivations. If I just get through this page, I'm going to have a Snickers bar. Now, of course, by the end of this, you're probably going to gain 15 pounds, but you'll have made it through by surrounding yourself with comfort food, if you consider candy bars comfort food or food in general. Number three, tag team if you can. Find a partner. Don't go at it alone. If the other person can help, even if it's just helping arrange things, help put things in order so that when you need to do something, they're doing something else. You're doing it together. It's so much easier to do things with somebody else than it is doing things alone, especially when it comes to something stressful like taxes. Number four, take breaks. I know people are, it sounds like a given, oh, take a break. Sometimes you can get so deep into it, like, no, 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 I'm going to do it. I got, I got to get through it. I got, I got, to, I got to finish it here. Oh, all I need to do is, is, is this one. Oh, 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 I'm not going to make it. I'm not going to have. That, that's just not, that's just not pretty. If you get to that point, get up. Walk away. Maybe take a power nap. Or, better yet, take a bath. Now, I'm not saying that your personal hygiene is bad. It might be. I'm just saying that it can help relax you. Let you just float away. You know you're going to get back to it. But for that hour, or that half hour, whatever time you take to break, just make that all about you. Don't think about what you left on that table. Just make it all about you then you can come back to the situation and continue. And if you enjoyed the bath, then you can say, well, then use that as a motivating factor. Okay, I'm just gonna work for a couple hours, a couple hours, set the little timer. Okay, I'm ready to go. Just take breaks. And then number five, this is something that I, you're likely not going to do. It'd be great if you did though. Uh, make a resolution, track your data throughout the year. Most people scramble to get all the information compiled at the last minute. What you don't realize is that throughout the year, if you stayed up to date with everything, kept track of things, had folders, have your system, whatever that system is, when it comes time to go through all of that data, you will be better prepared. There's hardware and software that can help you organize all that data. There's a service that I've recently learned about. I haven't used it yet but you can mail your receipts into this like remote location. They will scan it and help you index these receipts for you. Now it, is, it isn't free and you know, you definitely got to check into the security implications, but that just removes one more layer of stress potentially. Uh, you know, I've tried to arm our family with as much technology as I could. I picked up a, a scanner that comes in, uh, well, it comes in a package with software that will take receipts and help you organize them throughout the year so that, you know, you're not completely overwhelmed when it comes time to have to go through all that information. If you take it step by step by step, it's not so bad. You know, you one step at a time instead of just trying to run the whole flight of stairs in less than 24 hours. You're not doing yourself any favor. So at least if you make it through the year, make it a point. Call it a mid-year's resolution, a tax year's resolution to keep yourself organized starting today or starting tomorrow. Do not put it off until next year. Once you organize your life, it's easier to stay organized when you find your system. I'm telling you, I, you know, I keep things clean for a reason. I am about as organized as they come. And, you know, Ponzi, when we met, uh, my wife, uh, she has gained just tremendous 
knowledge about herself through the organizational components that I've kind of surrounded us with. Sometimes it drive her up the wall, but then again, I'm, I'm kind of always the, the neat freak around here. She's also, you know, imparted some wisdom to me as well, and I have lightened up a lot. Sorry, it was a little, it was, it was off by a little bit. I had to adjust it. It was driving me, uh, me nuts the whole video. This, this, this chapstick was on its side. I had to stand it up. It's better now. Don't worry. My email address is chris at perillo.com. Maybe you've got other tax tips, organizational tips, uh, dealing with stress tips. Feel free to pass them along. Uh, of course, you could also leave a, a comment, a follow-up. How do you deal with stress? Everybody deals with it differently. I'm guessing that most people in my audience deal with it by playing video games, which is a great motivational point too. Think about you know playing video games in between you know playing with numbers, unless the numbers are on the video game, which there aren't many video games that do that, at least anymore for adults. You're also welcome to stop by our website where I'm streaming my life pretty much 24 hours a day, seven days a week. Eh, sometimes I'm stressing out, and believe you me, everybody knows it before I do, and I'm the one stressing out. So you, you never really know what's going to happen. All you got to do is stop by and say hello. Streaming 24 hours a day, seven days a week at live.perillo.com. We'll see you later. Oh, I screwed that up. I gotta do, should I do the video again? I screwed up the I, my finger. Can, can I... I got I'm it's not very that's the the wrong I, I closed it the wrong way I